remote employees that need to interconnect with your network? If yes, then the most cost effective and reliable solution is VPN. Let's talk about how to keep network settings synchronized and keep those connections strong. Next. So using VPN, we actually want to maintain privacy. What if we have data in our hard drive and somebody steals that hard drive? He will definitely be able to read important and sensitive information inside. So what we would like to do, we would like to encrypt that data so that only we can read it. This encryption will be done through some algorithms and keys along with it. So algorithm and keys together will make this data encrypted. But this data which is stored in this hard drive is data at rest. On the other side, we also have a data which is in motion. So what to do about data which is in motion? The solution is virtual private network. A VPN extends private network across a public network to allow users to send and receive data as if their devices are directly connected. We send millions of packets every day on untrusted networks such as internet. We definitely would not want anybody to read that sensitive information and make sense out of it. We can do it by using confidentiality, integrity, and authentication. These three pillars combined together make VPN. Now in this design, we can see that there are three sites of a company that wish to talk to each other. And they do have a user which is probably sitting at home or at a remote location and wish to exchange information with all other PCs of the organization. We can see that two sites are using routers to connect with internet and there is a site that has a firewall made by Cisco ASA or FTD connecting this site with internet. Now the option for exchanging information between all of these PCs together are two. One, we send data clear text and there will always be a chance that somebody sitting over the internet can eavesdrop and can spoof the information and can replay that information later on for some illegitimate purposes. To protect from this type of threat which we have from a man in the middle which is usually present over the internet, we can send information over the internet by encrypting it. Encryption makes your information secure. In VPNs, if we connect these two sites securely together, we call this thing a tunnel. This tunnel can be created between routers as well as between firewall and a router and between two firewalls for that matter. So we have a tunnel between routers, we can have a tunnel between router and a firewall. And we can also have a tunnel originating from a PC landing on a router or maybe a firewall. All of these tunnels will allow these PCs to be able to exchange information with each other securely and reliably. We can send data across these tunnels without having fear of this man in the middle anymore. The tunnels that are created between routers or between router and a firewall are known as site to site tunnels or site to site VPN. And similarly, the tunnel which is created between a PC and a router, PC and a firewall is known as a remote access tunnel. So we can have remote access tunnels and site to site tunnels. We can use this 
word interchangeably as VPN. Hence, in order to understand VPN technology properly, we need to study site-to-site -site VPN technologies and remote access VPN technologies. In order to make you capable of handling the complexities of both site-to-site -site and remote access VPN solutions, we are going to launch a course named Implementing Cisco Secure VPN Solutions. In this course, we will cover VPN technology fundamentals, which includes encryption, hashing, and various different technologies, which are combined together to make VPN work. We will cover site-to-site -site VPN solutions. We will talk about iOS site-to-site -site Flex VPN. We will configure and understand Cisco iOS Get VPN. We will work on remote access VPN family, which is AnyConnect VPN and clientless VPN. During our journey, we will extensively talk about technologies like IPsec, IIC version 1, version 2, SSL, and digital certificates. I look forward to see you in this very exciting course of implementing Cisco Secure VPN solutions. Thanks for watching.